Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Hi Sagittarius, fire sign. Today I'm going to do general reading may or may not resonate to everyone. So take what resonates and leave the rest. If you like my content, please do like the video guys. Then it will reach more people. And thank you so much for supporting me. And if you want a personal reading, comment me in comment box and it is chargeable. And if you want to win a free reading, do like and comment on my videos. I will announce winner on every month, 30 and 30. So let's see your messages. Sagittarius, fire sign, sun, moon, rising and Venus. First, we will see general messages, then we will see love messages. Sagittarius, fire sign, sun, moon, rising and moon. So your recent past, your present, future and your present energy, Knight of Souls. Under the deck, Two of Swords. Okay, Sagittarius, you are searching for the clarity here, Two of Swords. Right now, you are at some crossroads. Uh, you need to make a decision regarding your career and finances, but you are not getting clarity. So you are unable to take decision right now. At the same time, Knight of Swords energy. You are in a very fast moving energy. You want to take things to next level regarding your job and career. Uh, you want to start something new. Maybe you want to start side hustle for extra money. Uh, but you are in very fast moving energy. So let's see recent past the world and Knight of Cups. So Sagittarius in recent past. You really worked hard to uh, get success and Knight of Cups you got some opportunity also because Knight of Cups is here you got some opportunity but what I am getting here you always make decision based on your emotions but you need to make decision based on your logic not based on your emotions uh, but i'm saying you got a big opportunity in recent past you worked hard and you got the opportunity then present seven of wands and three of fields okay right now you are so much focused on your career you are collaborating with other people regarding your work and uh, career and seven of wands means uh, you are in a very defensive energy you are involved in some competition you are playing both offensive and defensive And appreciate other people work also Sagittarius because when you are collaborating with other people appreciate other people's work also so future the lovers with the moon so in future definitely you will be have options regarding your career so make the right decision trust your intuition while uh, making the decision because the moon card maybe you will be in some confusion but uh, take some time just uh, listen to your inner voice and take your decision because the moon card represent trust your intuition and follow your inner voice definitely you will be have options more than two options for lots of you so let's see what a what are the messages for you regarding your career and finances Under the deck, five of swords, nine of wheels and eight of swords. So Sagittarius, definitely uh, you will focus on your career because you want to be financially independent. But uh, during this period, you will feel uh, stuck sometimes. So you need to be careful. Don't be stuck. Uh, especially thoughts wise, you will think the same thoughts again and again and you will feel stuck. And don't think about your past maybe something happened in your recent past you will think about your recent past then you will feel stuck so let go of your past completely focus on new beginnings focus on your money because nine of pentacles you have thoughts regarding uh, financial stability but uh, you will get some obstacles so don't feel stuck just move forward no matter what so let's see love messages 
your person current feelings towards you and your current feelings towards them and mutual energies your person present energy regarding this relationship and your present energy seven of pentacles okay okay I'm seeing a lot of uh, water energy and fire energy. Some of you are dealing with Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, especially Leo or Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, water sign. I'm seeing a person really love you so much, Sagittarius, because Ace of Cups is here. They are manifesting this relationship or you are manifesting them here. They are thinking that this connection has potential. They really do have feelings for you and they're thinking about communication here. So definitely your person either manifesting you back into their life or uh, they really want to come towards you and want to offer their cup of love. Yes, because they are in the magician energy, they present energy. And your current feelings towards your person, six of cups, six of wands and five of wands. You have some inner conflict within you regarding this person. You are spying them on social media, checking on them on a Snapchat, WhatsApp. You want success. You want reconciliation if you are in separation. If you are not in separation, you really want to talk to your person. Like very, very deep talks. Uh, you want to explain something to your person. Uh, six of Cups. And Sagittarius, you are feeling that this, uh, uh, you and your person have very strong soulmate connection. And waiting. You both are waiting for each other. Maybe for some no contact, com no communication between both of you. Some of you are dealing with Virgo, Ed sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, especially Virgo. And uh, Temperance, Temperance. Uh, some of you are dealing with under Sagittarius. So let's see you post an next action. I'm seeing for some maybe no contact here. You both are waiting for each other communication. But your person is thinking about communication Sagittarius. So let's see their actions. Okay, one card. Under the deck, the wall. The sun, two of cups. Wow, four of cups. I want to clarify four of cups. Three of wands. The fool. Definitely a person will come back because they're missing you a lot. They don't want to lose you. So they don't want to give up on this connection no matter what. Again, some of you are dealing with strong Leo energies here. Ending of your cycle and the beginning of your new cycle here. Definitely they are coming. Communication is coming. Sagittarius. So let's see what is the outcome of this relationship and where this relationship is headed on. The tower, three of swords, queen of pentacles and judgment, okay. So what I'm getting here, definitely a person realize you are the one for them and they're missing you a lot. Definitely they are coming back for new beginnings, a brand new beginnings. But here I'm seeing action or uh, no equal give and take is the main issue because Queen of Pentacles with Three of Swords. Saying words is one thing, but doing actions is another thing. So I'm seeing you, your person is saying so many words. They're expressing their feelings, but action wise, I'm seeing some difficulties here. Uh, no equal give and take. So, I want to clarify three of swords. See, four of pentacles and judgment means seven of swords. One thing is sure they are coming back for second chance, but I'm seeing a lot of issues here unresolved issues. Queen of pentacles, judgment.
So let's see. What is the advice for you regarding this relationship or situation? So think twice before making any decision. Don't overthink such areas. Uh, so yes, I'm seeing issues here. Definitely they do love you, but they're not putting efforts what I'm getting here. Definitely they are not putting efforts. Today they are saying, no, I really love you so much. I will give you time. I, I will put my efforts. But after two days or three days, they will not. So that is the main issue what I'm getting here. Because you, you are trusting this person, but they're breaking your trust every time. So let's see. Energy oracle messages. Journey, whatever is happening in your life, it's part of your uh, life. Uh, the journey and financial constraints, walking away under the deck. So some of you right now, you're facing some financial constraints, but it is a temporary Sagittarius and walking away. If you want to walk away from something that doesn't serve you anymore. So I think your decision is right. And bring love into the situation. You're born in Aquarius. And it's time to take action. So if you want to take action towards something, this is the right time. And bring love into the situation. Uh, so talking with your people, like your parents, family, or your person. Talk with them love. So this is the reading for you guys. Hope it resonates to you. Please do share, like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon. Then you will get all my video notifications. Thank you so much for watching and supporting me. Please do share, like and subscribe. Thank you.